hey guys welcome back to my channel so this video we're going to be starting off using the milk hydro primer um this primer makes my skin like really dry i don't know what the hype is about it but maybe i'm just like it's my skin during the win win uh, winter time girl get it right um yeah but it just makes my skin really tight i don't know if it's the moisturizer that i'm using or whatever but now i'm going in with the lancome foundation in 530c um as you can see it's darker than my face but it's the same color as my neck so i'm just gonna try to keep it as natural as possible um that's one of my struggles trying to find a good foundation because my face is definitely lighter than my neck so when i get a foundation that matches my face it's too light for my neck and i gotta tone it down with like bronzer and contouring and if I get one that's matching my neck, then I gotta brighten it up. So it's like, you know, your girl can never win, but it's okay. But yeah, like I said, we're just gonna keep it natural as possible. Um, it's closest to my skin tone. East mooch, east blue, bow. And I'm just using um, a flat foundation brush to blend everything out. And then I'm gonna go in and um, use my fingers for a concealer. So I'm using the MAC 24 hour um, skin concealer in nc50 and then i'm using the uh beauty bakery concealer and sugar daddy is the name of it and i've been loving this um this uh concealer so far it's really nice it you know blends really flawlessly as you can see but i'm using my finger this time um usually i'll use like a brush i'm using a brush to you know blend out the outer parts of the concealer but just to make sure the concealer is in the right spots, like my inner corner of my eyes, under my eyes, um, the places that I really can't get into, I'm using my finger because, you know, it's more precise and it also warms up the product to blend a little bit more, um, a little bit more nicely. I don't know what word to use, but, you know, you can see, obviously. But after that, I'm just going to blend it out with the Real Techniques setting brush. And then I'm going to do the same with my nose and like my chin in the area around my mouth. So for contouring, I'm using the hot chocolate uh, foundation stick from Flush. Eh, is it? F it's Flush, not Flush. I, I don't know what's wrong with my speech today. But um, this product I've been using for like maybe like three months now because I love it. It's just like it gives a nice warmth to my face. So I like using it um, a lot. I blend it out with a little powder brush um, going into the parts where... If I like make a fish face, um, the sunken parts that are right there. So go on with that around my forehead. And then I'm going to snatch this nose up real quick. Y'all going to see how I do that. I'm going into the inner parts of my eyes where my um, brow kind of goes in and then bring it down to where the bridge of my nose is. And then I'm just going to blend it out with those with my two fingers and then the finger with concealer. I'm just going to go back and forth and then make sure that everything is like, you know, lined up perfectly, blending perfectly and making sure that it goes um, in a line like a really nice snatched ass nose, period. So to set my concealer, I'm using the Stay Matte Not Flat Powder by NYX Cosmetics in the color Sienna. I like this powder because it gives a really natural, flawless look. Like, it doesn't give me flashback. It settles in the skin really nice. Um, but yeah, I, I really like this powder. I'm also going to take the, the second powder, which is the same product, but in a different color. This one's Cocoa, and I'm just going around my face just to make sure 
it gives a warm nice you know brown color that matches the neck but also you know blends into the sienna powder as well and then i'm going to take the same powder and then just go over that contour like li not liquid um uh cream and set that and now i'm going to use the sun bronzer by fenty beauty and i'm using the one that says coco naughty and as blush i'm using love joy by mac cosmetics so yeah i kind of go overboard with the blush because i don't know i like blush so much before when i was like you know first starting out doing makeup i hated blush so much i was looking like a flat ass bitch but now i love it gives me a little you know nice little oomph to the makeup so now i'm using the velour lash glue which is my favorite it dries really quick um it's, it lasted me a long time i have two of these so it's been lasting me a minute and it's only 12 dollars too so yeah and the lashes that i'm using oh this is the Too faced better than sex mascara um the waterproof one don't buy it because it's hard to get off i haven't learned my lesson but don't be like me and the lashes that i'm using are from amazon i will link them below So now I'm just setting my face with the Studio Fix uh, setting spray, lining my lips with a brown liner, and then I'm going to be taking a pink toned lipstick by MAC called Baby Doll, and then I'm going in with a light lip gloss to top it off, and yeah, that's it. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know in the comments. Be sure to like and subscribe, and I'll see you in my next video.